flyweight division matchup. Drillers make killers, and nobody works her takedowns harder than this young woman. She has become a force in this division, and even though the opposition oftentimes knows what's coming, no one's able to stop that shot. Nobody's able to stop that takedown attempt. No one's able to stop that single leg. She said in the fighter meetings, I have thrown that takedown 5,000 times. Amazing. Over and over, I hit a single leg. Every day of the week, I hit at least 30 single legs. I'm like, well, is wrestling practice every day? She goes, no. I just want to make sure that I have a skill that is so dominant that no matter how much you practice it, you are not practicing it enough to stop me from taking you down with it. It is truly crazy to watch her approach to getting that single leg off. And her ability to get her opponents off balance in a mixed martial arts setting, as special as anybody in the sport right now, we'll see how it goes for her here tonight. Well, she's one of the more exciting fighters in this or any division and really came into the UFC with some legitimate striking credentials and she's put those to good use in the big show. And that's why everybody was so excited about her UFC debut. They understood that they were about to witness something truly special. A striker, a fighter with an ability to finish fights with her legs, with her hands, with her elbows, with her knees. There was nothing, no tool at her disposal that she would not use. She was going to use everything gifted to her, and she has done that, and that's why her performances have been so great in the UFC. Yeah, she does not discriminate. She is a true, tried and tested eight-point striker, so try to put on a striking clinic here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, a referee in charge of the Octagon, Herb Dean. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out United Center in Chicago, Illinois. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC flyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This woman is a jiu-jitsu fighter, only a professional record of 11 wins, 5 losses. She stands 5 feet 4 inches tall, weighing in at 125 pounds. Fighting out of Brasilia, Distrito Federal, Brazil, Vivian Vivi Araujo! And now we're producing her opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This woman is a kickboxer, only a professional record of 16 wins, three losses. She stands five feet five inches tall, weighing in at 125 pounds. Alexa Grossa! You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. You will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it official. Ready. You ready to fight? Good. All right, here's the Mexican phenom, Alexa Grasso, ready to go for round one. Her UFC career began in fine form, obviously. A unanimous decision victory over Heather Joe Clark. We'll see how she chooses to attack here tonight. She has gotten progressively more patient as her MMA career has gone on, but there's no denying she's got the pop early. Her MMA career began with three first-round knockouts. Oh. She is such a diverse striker that she's gonna get some respect. She won't be as, she won't go as forward anymore. When you got a big power striker like that, you get to up again here, but hurting. That knee might have landed there. Well, she has gone to the well with these knee strikes throughout this fight tonight. Another nice combination there. Another combination of knees. What a fantastic job of finding the openings to land those over and over again. So just over 20 total strikes which have connected for Alexa Grosso. Nice one-two there. Man, I can't take pictures now. She has to react. She has to go 
chase the finish. Grosso's hook shot gets blocked. The defense saw that one coming. Attempts the front kick there. Oh, she got that gorgeous knee to find that midsection. I'm not sure. Oh! And just like that, the fight is over. It's over. It's over. Oh, yeah, just a brutal elbow to close the show for her here tonight. You can be sure you're going to see that on the highlight shows later tonight. It's one thing to go to it periodically. It's another thing to have those elbows be a major cornerstone of your repertoire. She really knows how to maximize range and to be effective with those in close. And she absolutely devastated her opponent here tonight. Well, there she is. Man, did she have it going here tonight as she gets the huge win by knockout. Near perfect execution. And that could be one of the better knockouts of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Gaines will the stop to this contest at two minutes, 56 seconds in the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Alexa Grosso! Well, you see the raw emotions and the happiness out of her in her corner. What a result here tonight as she gets it done by knockout. I mean, she could not have imagined that it would go this well. I know she said it would happen, but when it does, I mean, it's joy. It's joy like nothing you've ever felt before. You don't expect.